Sea Ranch for many, many years, and um, I have spent so many years uh, with an easel out on the bluff overlooking this gorgeous cove painting plein air. It's always a different experience. Every day you go out, the, the view, it changes, even if I'm in the, overlooking the same cove, the same rocks, the same beaches. It's that natural environment, the outdoors, the openness. Um, when I paint, I typically will add a lot more detail in the beginning, and the process of elimination is very um, in keeping with the way the environment is at Sea Ranch. Big open meadows, big open sea, horizon line with sea. I don't like to focus on the structure and put too much information that's very descriptive into a painting. My goal is to have, to, to welcome people into it and to kind of create their own narrative. Um, the inspiration comes from Sea Ranch. It comes from that openness and the, and, the, and the angles of the buildings and the angles of the structure. But once I start putting too much information that's descriptive and realistic into the painting, I find that the story is overtold. I, I like the feeling of, of vastness of landscape and also being a part of landscape, a part of nature. And when you have a solitary figure, maybe a few figures, um, you know, it's not, not a crowd necessarily, um, you get a sense of that, that big ocean, that big coastline, uh, the bluff trail that goes on for 10 miles. When you're at Sea Ranch, you, you do have a sense of kind of a oneness with nature, which it sounds so cliche, but I do find it to be very true.